Hi folks, it's Ron. In this video, I'll show you how to attach multiple conductors to the hook on the end of a metal fish tape so you can pull them through electrical conduits. Now if you're working with multiple conductors, that typically means you work with multiple circuits. So one tip would be go ahead and tape together the hot neutrals and grounds if you have them together so that you can easily identify them inside the electrical panel when you go to do your terminations. Now you notice I've only stripped the neutral wire of the three circuits and the neutral wires are what's going to get attached to the hook here. And this little bundle of wires that we create on the end of the hook is referred to as the head. And we need to make it as small as possible and maybe even try and taper it in such a way so that it easily pulls through the uh, electrical conduits without getting hung up on anything. So what we're going to do here is go ahead and attach the individual neutral wires to the hook and fold them over themselves. And then I'm going to use my uh, linesman's plier here and give that a good squeeze. Okay, to again minimize the size of it and get that hot wire out of my way here. And I'm going to do ahead the same thing with the second wire. Again, squeeze that one down with my linesman's plier as well. And then finally, that third neutral conductor. Okay. And again, I get all those hots kind of out of my way. And again, squeeze that last neutral wire. And again, kind of squeeze it all nice and tight. And then I'm going to go ahead and cut these hot conductors a little short of these ground wire or neutral wires. Oops. There we go. And that way, when I tape this bundle up nice and tight, hopefully it'll give us a nice, smooth transition between the fish tape and the electrical wires. And we're going to go ahead and tape all this up. And I'd say you probably want to tape up a good five or six inches of wires together. And again, I'm going to go over that little transition point one more time with tape. So hopefully, again, it doesn't get hung up on anything. And like I say, tape about five or six inches of your conductors, and we'll call that good right there. Okay. And there we have the wires attached to the hook on the metal fish tape. It's nice and smooth. It should pull through the conduits without any real effort. Uh, you can always add a little pulling lubricant if you need to, but uh, there you go, folks. Thanks for watching. I'm Ron with Ideal, and I'll see you on the next one.